The wonderful, beautiful morning audience. We're cleaning up the RV to get ready to move, and Eleanor has discovered the broom. She must have seen a broom before. She's like, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know. What is it? Dad's sweeping. See? He's getting rid of the dirt. What do you think? Oh, no one's going to get you. Look. Oh, man. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to get it. I had her all the way up on the bed when I showed it to her yesterday. She was like, whoa. It's not so scary today. She's like, today, I'm going to nibble on it. Okay. Yeah. Of course you are. <laughs> it's like brand new, so it's not dirty, it? Yep. Hmm. Let me help you, Dad. Yeah. All right, back up. He's going to open the door. Mm -hmm. Rule is, this got to be closed. Now you're stuck. What do you think, Miss Memphis? Good morning. I could move those so you're not so squished there. Memphis is like, this is my spot. And Kira's like, I'm just snuggled back here. We're getting ready to pack up and head on to the next campground. We're going to Traverse City because Memphis has her physical therapy appointment tomorrow. What do you think of that, huh? What do you think? What do you think of this broom? What do you think of that? We're going to get it. You know, I'm going to nibble on it. You're going to bark at it. You're goofy. <laughs> All right, cycling dogs again real quick before we take off. Thought I'd show you guys. So this is what we woke up to this morning. Super windy and it's uh, overcast. It's not raining, which is good. They said it was actually supposed to rain all day today. So we got away from that for now, but I think we're gonna hit it on the road. But at least I was able to walk the dogs without an umbrella, which is nice. So I'm gonna cycle them real quick. We're gonna load up and head down to Traverse City. Look at those fall colors. This wind is going to take a lot of those leaves off these trees, though. All right, do your duty so we can, like, go. <laughs> what do you think, girls? Ready to head out? It's super windy on the bridge, and we got to go across it, so this is going to get interesting. Oh, boy, I'm not looking forward to the bridge. But we got to get down there because, like I said, Memphis has an appointment tomorrow. So we're going to head to Traverse City. Supposedly, it's going to quit raining down there this evening, so maybe we'll drive through the rain all day, and maybe it won't be raining by the time we get there. We'll get to go do something fun in the evening. We'll see. we got a four-hour trip. Let's do it. Look, Jamie's got the Jeep all hooked up. <laughs> so we're driving through the campground. This is the, what do they call it, Woodland Woodland RV Park Campground, I think it's the name What's of the name it. Of this? Woodland RV Park Campground, I think is the name of it. It's been in business for over 50 years. There's like, what did I tell you, 136 sites. Mm -hmm. It's a pretty big campground. There's a pavilion over here. But the nice thing about it, there's there's the steps that Jamie carried Memphis down. <laughs> there is another set of steps over here, hon, but you chose the right set. I thought so. It looked like this was a bigger hill. Yeah. <laughs> and then that's Lake Superior right out there. And it's a very rocky slash sandy beach. So you can go down there and pick rocks. This section of the campground over there is actually closed. This is the other set of steps, but it's a lot of steps. <laughs> oh, I see it's starting to rain. Yeah, it's misty. It's gonna, we're gonna get it. And then there's like a little it's play area feet. over Turn there. Onto Carlton Street. See all the pretty trees over there. They got a couple bathhouse and shower houses and there's no, uh, it's not full hookup. You get electric and water for most sites, unless you stay over there. And you can also do tent camping here as well. That's the campground. All right. Oh, it's weird. I'm used to going that I know. direction. Okay. From yeah. here. So it's like, all right, well. We got to go this I'll way. Go back There's the little camp store that they usually have open that sells different things. That's the church we heard making noise. It did shut off at night. Did it? Yeah, it did. It didn't go off all night long. All right. And then we're going into Grand Marais and then down to Traverse City we go. So they redid this gas station, which is nice, yeah. but this is the little tiny town of Grand Marais. I think we showed it to you guys a couple of times. It looks like that restaurant's open again. Oh, it is. Oh, we could have ate there. But uh, that's pretty much it. That's the yeah. entire town. There was a post town. office and that was it. In the Pickle Barrel Museum. Right. Oh, they got another tavern there. Oh, that's pretty much it. Another church. There's a hotel. That's literally a hotel. And that's it. That was Grand Marais. If you ever want to come here, that's all you're going to get. <laughs> beautiful wilderness. Yes, absolutely beautiful. Even in the rain, it's still pretty. Yeah, I can see why there's a scenic overlook right here. Yeah, we should totally stop. I mean, in the rain, it might not be that great. <laughs> it might, not, it, might not be as scenic. Yeah, it is still really pretty here, though. Yeah, so you can look out of the water over there. Uh, I don't know, I think this is better than looking at the water right now. Right now, yeah. So we're kind of getting blown around in about 20 to 22 mile an hour winds and we're about 30 miles from the bridge so we'll see what happens when we get there. <laughs>
Jamie's a champion. Yeah. You're doing I'm so a, good. I'm gonna follow this tanker truck. <laughs> yeah, I see him way up there. Yeah. And the girls, they, they don't even know. They're just like, we're napping. We're happy as can be. I see you back there. Uh, yeah, I think the lake's a little angry. Yeah, it's a little angry today. That's uh, actually pretty crazy. That is uh, some wicked waves coming in. This is Lake Michigan. Those waves are huge. It's so, like, the camera just doesn't do it justice. Those, those are some pretty big waves for Lake Michigan. I mean, they're not superior sized waves, but yeah, this still is... still pretty big. Th it, looking this way, it looks really cool. Yeah. Let me zoom in a little bit here. Oh, we might have got this timing right for oh. me to go with the flag people. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, if the waves just crash. Yes. Oh, man. <laughs> High winds, reduce speeds, RVs and trailers, 20 miles an hour. Oh, we're gonna follow this fifth wheel across? Yeah, apparently Maybe. so. Uh, so, yep, we're at the Straits of Mackinac, we're at the bridge, and there's high winds, so <laughs> this should be fun. Oh, look at Domino's, man. Okay, here we go, don't blow us off. Don't blow us off the bridge. I won't blow us off the bridge. The girls are like, wait, where are we? The wind might blow us off the bridge. We're at the bridge, we gotta, we gotta pay to get home. We had to pay to come up here, and now we gotta pay to get back down. What do you think of that? They're like, wait, is this the lady that gives us snacks? Through the window? If she doesn't give you snacks, I will give you snacks. Deal? Mm -hmm. Deal. Literally 20 miles an hour. Flashers out. What's that guy doing? You can't pass him. He's like, I can go a little faster than this guy. Especially up there. Right, yeah, I guess. People don't realize that. Look at, can you tell? This is a hill. You have to go up a hill for the bridge, which is a little crazy. And there's the water we don't want to end up in. Okay, I'm putting the cameras down so I don't freak out too much. didn't fall in the water, which, uh, that's a plus. And there's less rain on this side of the bridge. That's a plus as well. Look at we made it to Potoski, and it's raining, but it's still pretty. It is. I forgot that we go through Potoski. There's the bay over there. Behind those trees, there's some water. Oh, is it, wait, <laughs> is this where the mushroom houses are? The mushroom houses are in Charlevoix. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah, don't forget to stop, huh? <laughs> yeah, the mushroom houses are in Charlevoix. Look at that red tree. So pretty. Mm -hmm. And we're still driving. Yep. We'll get there when we get there. Mm -hmm. Look, they still haven't built anything in that big corner lot where they were gonna build that giant building. No. Yeah. It's still empty. <laughs> I wonder why. I don't know, the developer that bought it, they had something all figured out and then the city of Potoski said no. Mm -hmm. So I think now he's just sitting on the property because he can. Mm -hmm. I mean, that happens. Cause that's, if you guys don't know, that's downtown Potoski is back up right in up. there. Yeah, right up there. And they were gonna build a really cool, shopping center and hotel or not hotels apartments and now it's just a big hole in the ground yeah it's like they dug it out to put two stories underground yep pretty much and then just left it that way yep we made it to our campground it's raining but it says it's gonna stop raining in about an hour to an hour and a half so that shouldn't be too bad if you cannot tell it is once again cold enough to have the furnace on, so the furnace just kicked on. It is 64 degrees inside the RV. Not too bad. Really, I don't mind that temperature at all, but I turned the heater on just to be sure. Now this campground that we're at has full hookup, so we'll have water and sewer and of course electricity, which is kind of nice. This is a pretty nice campground. So I think we actually, Jamie's gonna disconnect the Jeep. He's hooking everything up right now. I think we're gonna load up the dogs since it's raining and take them to PetSmart. Cause we're in Traverse City, Michigan, if I didn't say it. We're actually in Buckley technically, but we're right outside of Traverse City. So there's a PetSmart and a Pet Supplies Plus and a couple places we can take them. So we might go do that while it's raining, take them to have a little bit of fun. And then hopefully it'll be done. We'll come back here and we'll do some camping things. And then tomorrow morning, Memphis, we are about 15 minutes away from the rehab center from here. So tomorrow morning, and you guys will see that. I'll take her to go do that. These two girls will hang out with dad. And then after that, we'll head home. I think that's the plan. What do you think? They're like, well, we just, we just would like outside, please. Yeah, in a minute, I will let you all out, I promise. Okay, so the rain has lightened up quite a bit and Jamie and I have made a decision based on you. So PetSmart has very slippery floors and we really don't want Memphis to get hurt. 
And the dogs can get kind of crazy when they go in there. So you've been there quite a few times. You've been there quite a few times. You have not been there that many times. So I'm going to take Eleanor real quick. We're going to run to PetSmart. We're going to get a few new toys for the RV because I noticed this basket's looking a little slim. So we'll get some new toys. I'll get some treats for these girls. Jamie's going to hang out with these two. And I'm going to take Miss Eleanor with me. Eleanor. Eleanor. Want to go with me? Yeah? Let's go. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, she's like, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. We made it to the Pet Smart. I got Miss Eleanor. Hi, you wanna go into Pet Smart? You wanna go to Pet Smart, pick out some stuff for your sister since you got to go and they didn't get to go. Does that sound good to you? He's like, yes, yes, please. Let's go. Ready? Wanna go in? Let's do it. Are you ready to do this? No, you haven't done this too much. This, 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 you're okay. And you're without your sister, so you're like, I'm a little freaked out. Come on. I think. Look at all the stuff, and look, there's people. You're definitely a little freaked out. And there's, look, there's another dog. Look at that pretty dog. I know, there's You're in here making all the friends, I told you. What's over here? What's that? Look, it's the kitty feet. You don't even realize there's anything in there. You're, you're not, look, there's birds in here. Come here, look, look. There's birds in there. You, she don't even realize there's anything in these stages. <laughs> uh, you, what, you want to pick out all the Halloween stuff? Look okay. at so many cute things. What are you gonna get? Okay, let's look this way. Look, the Halloween things are this way. Should we get some Halloween toys and Halloween treats? I think that's the plan. We we'll get a couple. We we'll get you. A, those are cat costumes. Look okay. at. There's so much fun stuff. This is the aisle with the most smells. And you walked past all of them. Come here. Whoa, that's all the smells. All the smells you never smelled before, huh? She's like, whoa. I would take all of these, please. One of each, please. One of all of them. <laughs> we did it. We got our little pet smart haul. All right, let's get back to the campground because it quit raining. Maybe we'll go walk around the campground with your sisters. What do you think? She's like, there's people and dogs. I made a friend. That's great. <laughs> Let's go. So I made it back from PetSmart. I'll show you guys the PetSmart haul when we get back. But before it gets dark, we're gonna go walk the dogs around this campground and check it out. Look out, you'll pinch your paws. Look out, you'll pinch your paws. She's like, I figured out how to open this. She sure did. Hey. <laughs> no! no! You broke the rules. Get back, get back. Okay, I gotta help Jamie. And they're walking. Oh yeah, there's like lots of mushrooms over here. Oh. So, maybe I shouldn't have walked this way, but I did. <laughs> what are you screaming for? What are you yelling about? Oh, look, Jamie, there's a Seneca. <laughs> Jaco Seneca. No, we're not. Oh, yeah, look at. I gotta, I gotta show the audience this one. Look at this giant mushroom. It's huge. Okay, no mushrooms for the dogs. Come on. Oh, look at you running. <laughs> Okay then. I don't know where they're going, but they're going. So the section of the campground that we are currently at is called the Ridge. And there's a couple different sections of this campground. We're not gonna go walk through all of them because this is a huge campground. So we're way back over here there. Then you come down in this area and there's some more treed areas. And then I guess way over there, there's like an island area and a lake. I think they're walking you today, hon. I could tell they've been in the car all day. Even Memphis is like, this is amazing. And it's cold, yeah. so they have cold weather brain. You're dragging a little there, girl. Oh, look, a sidewalk. Look, some air streams. Yeah, we're gonna wander up and then go back. We won't be out for too long. Short walk, cousin Memphis. She's definitely toe dragging. <laughs> this is the in the woods area. Ah, back up. And you can see how pretty all of this is. Yeah. But right there where that car went, apparently goes down to the lake. There's some lake view lots over there. And then down there, there's a whole bunch of lake lots and you can stay on an island. So there's an island down there. And Silver Lake is over there. Well, we're gonna wander back this way, back towards our campground. You can kind of see the lake from here. That's like the edge of it. It's actually a pretty <laughs> high glowing Memphis. It's actually a pretty decent sized lake. This is a nice lot here. Mm -hmm. You get to look at that all day. Nice fire high glowing, Kira. Nice fire pit yep. here. Pretty mm. wood. And it's kind of cool. So like if you look, hi Eleanor. If you look over here, so you park your rig there and then there's a little steps up and then you have your fire and sit and look at the lake. Oh, and there's steps down so you can go down. Beautiful. Whoa, Memphis, are you interested in the toy? You're not supposed to be up there, ma'am. I was gonna show it a PetSmart haul. What do you think? What'd we get? We got 
some campfire s'more treats. We got some Franken snacks. We got this crinkly raccoon that I think you guys saw Eleanor pick off of the shelf. We got a crinkle bunny. Apparently that's hers. She says that's not. You want this one? I think that's hers as well. And then we got it's Maleficent's dragon. And that's hers too. I was trying to show everybody what we got. And somebody's chewing on my shoes as well. So we got three toys and two bags of treats. What do you think? Would you like a snack? Mm -hmm. like <laughs> She's like, this is, this is fun. It squeaks. So we got some new toys. That. Yeah, you can open it for them. I'm going to open the snacks real quick. So these are what s'mores taste like, okay? You can taste it. Is it delicious? <laughs> you two, just push it right out of the way. Okay, you next. Was it good? And one for you? Was it good? That's what s'mores tastes like. All right, and Daddy's opening your toys. And I'm like, me, I want that one. I want them all. I'm gonna play with all the toys and eat all the snacks. <laughs> There, now you got a couple new toys for the trailer. And I think I'm gonna make us some dinner and make the dogs some dinner. It was a little colder out than we thought. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely cold. You already showered and I think I'm gonna shower after I make everybody food. And then we'll watch some more Lord of the Rings. <laughs> <laughs> I think everybody looks pretty exhausted. We didn't do a whole lot today, but we drove a lot today in the wind and that was pretty exhausting for all of us. Oh, and by the way, that brand new toy. I'm gonna show them, show them Eleanor. Show them what you did with your brand new toy that you just got from the Pest Marts. Say, I, I ate it. I ripped a hole in it. You sure did. Made you happy though, didn't it? So now you have an unstuffed toy that can hang out in the camper. Memphis, you can't sleep there. You gotta get in the bed. Alright you guys, we're gonna go ahead and call it a night here. I gotta get up super early in the morning to take Memphis to her appointment. So we hope you... You're still tearing that apart. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video as always. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. And we will see you again soon and yes we finished all three lord of the rings and now we're watching the first of the hobbits i don't think we're gonna get through all these before we make it home though hon no it <laughs> definitely makes me tired yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah we're only on the first one so it's been nice to be able to actually watch some show oh curious went to bed she's like these steps are great it's been nice to be able to watch some movies when we have the downtime in the evening so anyway 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 good night audience